Thank you for clicking Dr. Samurai Minute Lecture. In this video, I would like to answer the question of why so many people continue to deny climate change. My name is Dr. Samurai. I'm a professor specialized in international social pathology. Climate change and climate crisis are such a big topic today. And uh, so many people, especially uh, young and active people who worry about their own future, led by Miss Greta Thunberg, are fighting against uh, world leaders who are unwilling to uh, act swiftly on this uh, climate change issues. And why are there still so many people who are continue to deny climate crisis? Oh, if you like this kind of discussions, please click that the green and yellow Gulag Chem logo. I am basing this discussion on an article titled, Here are five of the main reasons people continue to deny climate change, written by Mr. Mark Maslin for the conversation for environment. In short, it says uh, fossil fuel industry, political lobbyist, media moguls, and individuals have spent their past 30 years sowing doubt about the reality of climate change, where none exists. And uh, this article points out uh, five reasons why climate change den deniers do so. One is science denial. They say, actually, uh, climate change is not uh, really happening, but uh, there's already a clear consensus of, among uh, scientists that uh, global temperature has been rising steadily in spite of uh, minor fluctuations. And the number two is economic denial. Climate change deniers point out to fix climate change is too expensive. However, in reality, spending 1% of world GDP will fix the climate change today. Number three, humanitarian denial. Climate change deniers say, actually, warmer winters are more preferable. However, 2010 Moscow heat wave killed uh, 11,000 people. And uh, currently, more than 40% of the world population live in tropics. And uh, global warming is damaging in terms of human health perspective and also an increase in desertification. Besides, those who die in the cold weather are actually dying due to poor housing and not being able to afford heat in their homes. Number four, political denials. Climate change deniers argue we cannot start to take action because other countries are not taking action. However, this is not true either because uh, most of the cumulative emissions or by United States, EU, China, Russia, Japan, and India. So, climate change is the issue primarily to those countries who produce more CO2. And number five, crisis denial. Climate change deniers go, we should not rush into changing things because there are so many uh, uncertainties about uh, global warming. And uh, our current life is uh, comfortable enough. But uh, this article is concluding. Why are we allowing the people with the most privilege and power to convince us to delay saving our planet from climate change as we did the same thing with the ending slavery, granting the vote to women, banning the smoking, and so on. Now, seeing 
all these、uh, five reasons of、uh, climate change deniers. What can we say? I think what this article asserted at the very end represents what this、uh, climate denying is all about. All these、uh, scientific, economic, humanitarian, political, and、uh, crisis denial is by those who are enjoying current power and privilege. This is it. Now they are enjoying the highest peak of their lives. Because of that, they have most power. And money in the world. They do not want to、uh, lose their current privilege. And here comes why they are spreading so many lies about the、uh, realities of climate crisis and climate change. All these、uh, denials about、uh, climate change are to protect privileges. Of such a limited number of privileged people in today's world, they don't care about、uh, coming apocalypse or perishing Earth or devastating environmental destructions. They don't even care about、uh, nuclear wars because they have money to、uh, protect themselves. Whatever happens. To the 99 percent of the public, even if the world becomes so hot, they can、uh, enjoy cool air in their homes. They can also purify their airs against、uh, air pollution. They can、uh, buy and create、uh, purified waters. Even in the case of the、uh, nuclear war, they can have shelters in which. They can enjoy secure and peaceful life till they die. They have that much money. Most of the people do not understand. Those、uh, super elites do not care about、uh, middle class people who、uh, mistakenly believe they are winners. They are not winners because、uh, they cannot、uh, make sure of the safety of their lives like those one percent super rich can do. In case of emergency, they are deceived by those lies because they can be enjoying a decent level of comfort in today's life. But、uh, again, it cannot last forever. We all must make a decision on which side we will stand. Are we going to stand on the side of super rich? Who don't care about us and、uh, whose lifestyle we cannot afford in case of、uh, world crisis, or we general mass get together not to make our environment worse than now, so that、uh, everybody can enjoy peaceful life on this small miracle planet Earth, where. So many green still exist, and so many、uh, wonderful living beings still exist. After all, Earth is the only planet confirmed where living beings are existent, and we are also part of it. Without the miracle of this planet, we are not being here at this moment. Because this planet is covered with the greens and living beings, it is so special in the universe. Because this is one and the only living planet, and the, those super elites who are spreading all those lies about climate crisis and、uh, climate change are destroying this.、Uh, Miracle living planet. This is it, and I would like you to think about、uh, my message. And I also like to、uh, hear what you have to say about my suggestions. If you like this kind of serious discussions, 
please click the uh, red Dr. Samir logo. Wherever you are, my friend, on this small planet Earth, during this uh, very short period of our life. Okay, thank you very much and bye-bye now.